Hey, did you know that William Shakespeare actually mentioned Palestine? Hi, my name is Riley. I talk about Shakespeare, but also I talk about things that matter. But yeah, in Act 4, Scene 3 of Othello, there is a mention of Palestine. Amelia says to Desdemona, I know a lady in Venice who would have walked barefoot to Palestine for a touch of his nether lip. Now, why is this mention important? Does it have a big bearing on the plot? Does it have some bigger thematic significance? No, not really. But here's the important part. Othello was written in 1604 and probably performed around the same time. His first quarto version wasn't published until about 1622 after Shakespeare's death. The reason that this is important is that it goes to show how long Palestine has been around and how long it has been culturally significant that a play written centuries ago mentions it. Now, does that mean we're looking to an old British playwright who has never set foot in Palestine to validate an entire people and their culture and their history? Absolutely not. But it is important to recognize that the Palestinian people have been around for a very long time. Because there have been various attempts to minimize and erase Palestinian culture and history, We've seen claims by Israeli officials saying that there is no Palestinian people, that there is no history or culture, and that's simply untrue. Due to social media and the widespread access to information we have here, we've not only seen direct reports on the genocide that's happening in Palestine, but also from members of the Palestinian culture and community sharing cultural artifacts, sharing recipes, sharing historical artifacts, sharing stories, and that's so important. Because one of the tactics of genocide is removing people from their culture. They're already being removed from their homeland, and now they're being told that their own culture doesn't exist. One of the people of Palestine are incredibly resilient, and they have such a rich and vibrant history and culture. Keep being loud, keep amplifying their voices, keep calling to end this genocide. Free Palestine.